What's up guys, this is Kelly from Sawyer in the Middle. Um, today we're gonna do a little review. Um, we just went to Lowe's and got a chainsaw, the uh, Craftsman style. We're gonna check it out and see how it goes. Chainsaw we got today is the Craftsman S180. Got it from Lowe's. Um, it's normally $179.99. Today they had it on sale for like, I think $159.99 plus the 10% uh, off military. That's why we always shop Lowe's. Um, so we've got a pretty good deal here. We got this, um, the safety stuff already had, and then we got the bar and chain oil and the true fuel to go in it and never can go without your flaming bag of hot Cheetos. Um, all for under $200 today. So let's hope this works. We'll give you an honest review of how this chainsaw does. First thing I noticed was it does come in this nice heavy duty carrying case, which will come in handy for sure. For inside the box here, um, of course you've got the saw itself. Looks like it comes with some two cycle engine oil, a very small bottle that won't last you very long. A replacement chain which is nice because you're probably going to need that to know how much work you have to do. And in the instructions, it has a, um, looks like a, maybe a tool to change the uh, blade. So here's the saw itself. Um, like I said, it's the Craftsman S180. It's the 18 inch blade, um, 42 cc. We have a kind of small job we're going to cut down some small trees we are not doing our big trees i'm just not that skilled at cutting down trees i'll pay somebody to do that but i can definitely do the small ones um also in here it says you know it's kind of kind of step-by-step -step guide here um, it tells you what kind of fuel to get um and not to forget the bar and chain oil which i did buy here because I don't think it, I don't, it didn't come with that. So you gotta buy that separate, don't forget that. We got the cover off. Um, you can get a better look at the actual chain itself, the 18 inch. Um, this features a lightweight design. Um, like I said, with the 42 cc engine, it's got the, the bucking stops here, automatic chain brake. It has the full wraparound aluminum handle, the easy pull start here. Here we have the 40 to 1 fuel oil mix where you put that in. Also, this is for your bar and chain oil. We'll go in here. Over here is your air filter. That's how you get into your air filter there. That's your cap. Um, looking at the back here, you have your on and off switch. Um, you have your choke here. Pull that out. You have your primer bulb. You have your throttle lockout. You have your throttle control. On this side of the saw, we have your bar retaining nuts here. Here you have a um, screw to adjust your tension on your chain. You need to do that you have your chain catcher here and this is your bar cover saw here it gives you some pretty detailed instructions on the process of going through and starting your saw there also here on the guard tells you how to do it so hopefully it's not that hard to do okay, let's open up this air filter here and see what it looks like so we're going to unscrew this Pull off the top here, and there she is. And you can pull that out for cleaning. All right guys, so I got it all fueled up. Um, we're gonna try to crank it up and see how it goes.
of working all day in the yard using this Craftsman 18 inch. I'm um, gonna give you my honest thoughts on it, whether it was a good purchase or not. Um, I am very happy with it. Uh, I cut down a lot of trees. Now my trees were not very big. I cut down a lot of uh, the smaller trees. Um, this thing went all day long, never quit on me. Um, all I had to do is put fuel in it and put the, uh, the bar, uh, bar and chain oil in it and it ran all day cut through those trees like like butter no problem whatsoever now i'm sure if you're doing a really big job you're going to need something bigger than this but i'm just your average joe in his backyard cutting down some small trees work perfect for me i wish you the best of luck and your job